my name is Harshal. I'm a professional cricket coach. In this web series, we'll be talking about batting. In the first episode, I'll be covering the stunts. When you start playing cricket, it's important that you learn skills before you even hold a bat. You're best prepared for when you play the bowlers. So before you even hold the bat, it's important to notice your position in front of the stumps. It's important to get your feet shoulder width apart. Your head should be, always be still with your eyes level. If your eyes are going all over the place, you won't be able to see the ball. Your arm should be relaxed. The weight on your feet should be on the ball of your feet in the center. So you can go back or you can go forward. If I show you a side one, you can see that my feet are aligned. My arms are in a diamond formation, and my hands are quite spaced out on the back. It's important to have a relaxed stance at the crease so you can move around and you can play off the back foot or the front foot. When batting at the crease, you should have your head still with your eyes level. That way you can see where the ball is coming from and you can follow it. Your feet should be in equal distance, shoulder width apart. Once all that is in place, you look at where your feet are positioned. They should either be in line with leg stump, middle stump, or just in front of leg stump. It allows you to move across the wicket on the back foot or move forward to play a shot. Once you have your stance in, in order, you can pick up a bat and we can work through some of the basic shots.